Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel today. My name is Christian and today we're here to talk about the brand new EP from Mastodon. It is titled Cold Dark Place and this follows up their full-length record Emperor of Sand that came out earlier this year. Now Emperor of Sand is a record that is actually in a knife fight for my album of the year. It's between that and three other records. I'm not going to say what those are because I don't want to ruin my end of the year list but it's such a great record and this EP was originally rumoured as another full length record and was also rumoured to be kind of a Brent Hines solo record that turned into a Mastodon record and after listening to this EP I can definitely hear why this may have originated as a Brent Hines solo record. Of course uh, these four songs were recorded in the Emperor of Sand era and in the Once More Around the Sun era and while this may have originated as a Brent Hines solo record, this is absolutely a Mastodon record all the way through and Troy and Bran are all over this record vocally as well. This EP is fantastic, it really encompasses everything that you would love about Mastodon. It has the heaviness, it has the progressiveness and it has the melodies that have started to become a massive part of their sound. And I really hope that this isn't just a throwaway EP that they're never going to talk about or never going to play live because I'd love to hear these songs live. I love hearing Brent take more of a front and centre role to Mastodon because on this EP he really does seem like the front man even though Troy and Brian do trade off vocals with him. He is on this EP more than he is usually on Mastodon records. Songs like Northside Star and the title track Cold Dark Place really show off what a great vocalist Brent is and the instrumentation that backs up all the songs on this EP really suit his voice. And this EP leans more towards the progressive sound of Mastodon. While it still has the heaviness, it still has the melodies, these songs are very, very expansive and the guitar playing is spectacular. The highlights for me guitar playing wise are definitely Northside Star and Toe to Toes with the solo that leads out Northside Star being one of my favourite moments on this EP. It's absolutely breathtaking. And as well as the guitar playing being fantastic, the melodic writing on this EP is incredible. The melodies have just started getting better and better with each Mastodon release and something that makes those melodies sound so so big is the harmonies that back them up. You can definitely hear that all the way throughout the EP and it makes some choruses sound even bigger than they would if it was just the melody. These choruses are really arena ready and they just sound colossal. One of my favourite moments on this EP is definitely Troy's vocals in the track Toe to Toes, a track that very clearly came from the Emperor of Sand recording sessions. I love Troy's voice. It has that very distinct metallic tone to it while still being incredi incredibly sorry, melodic. He's a real master of that and on this EP he really shows that off. As the name suggests, this EP is a lot darker than Emperor of Sand was. Even though Emperor of Sand had a very dark subject matter, the use of story to create the visuals for that record made it feel more like someone telling you a story rather than it being so personal and so introspective like this EP is. And yeah, it's just a lot darker, but I love it for that. Overall, I really, really love this EP from Mastodon. I'm just going to keep this review short because it's only talking about four songs. I don't want to just keep talking on and on and on about it I want you guys to go and listen to it so let me know what you think of the EP down below in the comment section did you like the EP did you not like the EP let me know down below we can have a conversation about music so let's do that but if you're just going to fill up the comment section with hate and insults just know I'm going to read your comments and laugh at how pathetic your life is anyway thanks for watching my video today guys please hit subscribe down below and I'll see you next time fresh currents